Hey, what's up guys? Michael here and it is Thursday, April 28th, 2022 and this is your weekly update. So right off the bat, this is a pretty special week for me. I actually have a new book coming out tomorrow on the 29th. It is called Pray No More. It is book two in my Shifty PI mystery series. And I've been talking about this book for a while. It took me a little bit longer than I had planned to get out, but it's finally here tomorrow. And on that note, tomorrow, Friday, here on YouTube, I am going to be dropping a video where I will be reading chapter one of that book. So make sure you subscribe, hit that bell to get notified when that video drops. In terms of what I'm working on, I am still currently working on my next novel, which is going to be uh, as of yet untitled horror supernatural suspense novel. Uh, I'm about 7,000 words into that, maybe closer to eight. So that's coming along really nicely. Still no estimated date of when I think I might get it finished, but so far the progress has been pretty nice. And I think I might be able to write this one pretty quick. Switching over to what I am reading, I just finished reading Layla by Colleen Hoover, and uh, I gotta say I really enjoyed it. It was a nice kind of refreshing take on a haunted house kind of possession and romance story all wrapped up into one. I definitely enjoyed it. And talking about what I'm watching, I didn't actually get to watch any television shows this week, but this past Sunday, I did watch a film I've been looking forward to. It was called X by Ty West, written and directed by Ty West. And if you are a Ty West fan, you probably know about this film. If not, you should definitely go check out some of his previous work, like The Innkeepers and House of the Devil. This is right along with his normal style of slow burn horror, and it really takes off near the end. And I got to say, I was really impressed with the theme that he managed to wrap into this film, which otherwise would have just kind of been another generic slasher, but he definitely put a twist on it that made it very interesting. Um, it was just as good as I hoped it would be, and I definitely recommend it. Anyway, guys, that is it for this week's weekly update. Thanks so much for watching, and be sure and come back tomorrow to watch that video of me reading chapter one of my new book, Pray No More. I will see you next week.